Hello, football fans and Stratomatic football fans. I'm here again with another divisional matchup in my series of divisional football matchups. And today it's going to be the San Francisco 49ers hosting the Seattle Seahawks. As you can see, I'm going to have the regular scoreboard up. We will stop it at various times for kicks and things like that. But other than that, um, you know, as in the past, other than that, we will just let it run. And uh, this way you can see what the score is wherever you are in the video. If you're like listening to it, but then you want to look up and see what's going on. So without any further delay, let's get on with it. Um, the 49ers will kick off to the Seahawks and that is a six I only needed the two d sixes but anyway um, six is negative eight in the end zone back number one they'll just take it on the 25 first and ten right there and they are going to come out with an end run with their halfback and in this particular case that's going to be Chris Carson uh, if you know the Seahawks from 2020 this is by the way is 2020 you've got Chris Carson and Carlos Hyde in the backfield with Russell Wilson at quarterback and he has Jacob Hollister at tight end uh, DK Metcalf at split end and Tyler Lockett at flanker so that is a six on the defense for end run on the San Francisco defense. And that is going to be four yards. So we've got a second and six. Second and six, they're going to go off tackle with the fullback. And uh, that's going to be Carlos Hyde. And that is a seven on his off tackle and that's one yard even being wrong that was only one yard so it's third and five they're going to go flat to the tight end on third and five and that is a seven on flat pass on russell wilson and um they were um they were looking for the pass, so that was four yards. And now they've got a decision. They got a fourth and one. And they're going to try to go for it. Let's see. Let's check out Wilson on the line buck. Buck with with the quarterback. Fourth and one. It's a risky call. But they're doing it. I mean, this is something that obviously Pete Carroll wouldn't really do. But I am. They are, well, it doesn't matter. It's on the defense. And it's a line buck three, which is a short gain. And the short gain is going to be eight, which is 15 yards. So that was a nice run. One, ten, and three. And it's first and 10 for Seattle at the 48 yard line. They're going to go, they're going to come out and go long. They're going to go long to the flanker. Yeah, long to lock it on this. And they are looking for the run. And uh, that is an eight on long pass eight on Russell Wilson. And it's incomplete. So they're going to go short to the split end because now having missed on the first down uh, play and not getting anything, they're locked into having to go pass. So 
That is, they're looking for the pass, and it is a seven short pass on the San Francisco defense, and that's going to be 10 yards and a first down. So now they have a first and 10 at the 47-yard line of the uh, 49ers, and they're going to go end run to the halfback, and this time it is going to be uh, back to Chris Carson. And it's possible offensive penalty, and it's a five on his card, which is going to be a possible fumble. Um, they are, they're looking for the pass, so it isn't a fumble. It's uh, zero yards. But uh, for the penalty, they have, let's see, four. Four on the possible penalty, which is... Number five, it will be a penalty. Offense five is holding 10 yards from the original line of scrimmage. So they have a, a first and 20. Um, no, it's a second and 20. Is it? No, it's first. I think it was first down. I think they had just gotten a first down. So it's a first and 20. They're going to go end run with the half back again. thinking probably that correctly that San Francisco may not be looking for it. They're not, and it is a 10, end run 10 on the San Francisco defense, which is four yards. So they have a uh, uh, second and 16. Now they're going to go short to the split end. Short to the split end, that is a seven, and they're looking for the run. Seven, and they're looking for the run, and uh, that can't be right. Let me see. Second and 16. It is indeed. They are looking for the run. So it is a, it is a well, it's a seven on the short pass defense of San Francisco which is 10 yards. So they have a third and six. Um, third and six, they're going to go flat to the tight end. Back to the flat pass. Try to keep possession, keep the ball away from San Francisco. That is a four, short pass, four, uh, flat pass four on the San Francisco defense, and it's a possible defensive penalty. Um, it's intercepted 2 or 12, and it isn't. And the uh, possible defensive penalty is 4 on the San Francisco card, and it's number 3. Defensive pass interference, uh, and it was a short it was relatively short, so it was 50, it's a 15-yard penalty because, of course, you can't have a spot foul. You don't know really where they were. So 15-yard penalty, key 15-yard penalty by San Francisco moves Seattle down to the 23-yard line of San Francisco, and they're going to try a short to the split end. They're going to try to just put the ball right in the end zone right now. And that's another possible defensive penalty. It's a short three, um, and they are looking for the run. Um, short pass three is incomplete, um, but there's a possible defensive penalty. And that is a four. That's going to be something. It is. It's offside. So it's going to be a first and five. For the Seahawks, and now they're going to go end run with the halfback. And that is a 6 5 end, um, end run 5 on San Francisco defense. It's going to be fumble negative 3, 2 to 4, or 12. And it is a fumble. And uh, let's see, what was it? Negative 3. And 2-6 to six or 12, the Seahawks recover. They don't. 
So San Francisco will take over as the Seahawks have a key fumble. And now San Francisco is at their own 21 going the other way. And uh, to introduce the San Francisco uh, offense, we're going to have Jimmy Garoppolo, even though he did not attempt as many passes as one of the other quarterbacks, we're still going to go with Garoppolo. That's the guy everybody knows. That's the guy who's stuck. In the backfield, you're going to have Raheem Mostert and Kyle Juzik. Jik, jik, jik. I don't know how you pronounce his name. Then you got uh, Brandon Ayuk at flanker, Debo Samuel at split end, and at tight end, you're going to have George Kill. So a lot of those guys are well known, and they're going to go end run with Raheem Mostert. And that's a possible offensive penalty, but it's a three, and uh, they were looking for the pass. So it's a three on his end run card. Wrong, which is only three yards, but let's see if there was an offensive penalty on them, nine. It's opponent offsides. So it actually goes, refers to Seattle for the penalty, and it's a first and five, and they're going to go off tackle with the fullback, the Scrabble guy with a name that I can't pronounce. And that is an eight, and um, they are looking for the. They're looking for the pass. No, they're looking for the run. They're looking for the run. And it's an eight, but it doesn't matter. It's an eight uh, off tackle on the Seattle defense. And that is zero yards. So they have, and by the way, I should mention that Seattle is good to excellent against runs and they are poor against passes. And San Francisco is average to poor against runs and good against passes. So anyway, this brings up a second and five, and they're going to go long to the flanker on second and five because they're going to figure, hey, we can probably get this anyway. So that is a seven, and they are looking for the run. They're solidly looking for the run, and it is a seven on the long pass defense, which is a negative nine. So they have a long way to go to get a first down. It's third and forever. Third and 10, 50, third and 15. They're going to go short to the split end. Their only chance of getting out of this rut is to do a pass, obviously. And that is going to be a 10. And they are looking for the pass. Short pass, 10 is incomplete because they were looking for it so they will have to punt and we will stop the clock as san francisco punts the ball and that's an 11 it's a terrible punt it's 36 back one so 4 10 20 30 and two and back number one is returning it that's an 11. That's a fumble negative one. Two to six or 12, they get it back. They don't. So San Francisco again takes over on another Seattle um, turnover. A key Seattle turnover, I might add. And so now they have a first and 10 at the Seattle 47-yard um, line. And they're going to go end run with Mostert to start it out. And that's going to be a three. End run three is going to be a short gain, but it's a possible defensive penalty. <coughs> Eight is 14 yards. But let's see if there was a defensive penalty on Seattle. Eight. There wasn't. So they get 14 yards. Two, ten, two. And now they have, San Francisco has a first and 10 at the 38-yard line of the uh, Seahawks. And they're going to go short pass. No, you know what? They're going to go flat to the tight end. Uh, 
flat to the tight end, and that is a six um, on the quarterback's card when they are not looking for the pass. So six flat pass on Garoppolo is 10 yards and a first down. Very nine. So now they've got a first and 10, San Francisco does, deep in, San, in Seattle territory at their 23 yard line and they're gonna go end run with the halfback. No score so far, minute 24 and picking down in the first quarter. They are looking for the pass, and that is a seven. End run seven on Seattle's defense is one yard. So they have a second and nine. They're going to go um, short to the split end. I mean, it worked. It got them down there, so why not, right? And possible defensive penalty, it is a seven, and they are looking for the pass. And it is incomplete. And let's see, let's roll for the possible defensive penalty. It's an 11 on Seattle, and it's opponent number five, which is going to be um, holding in 10 yards from the line of scrimmage. So. So they're going to have a first and <coughs> um, first and twenty. They're going to go end run with the halfback. And that is a three, and that's going to be a short gain, and there's no any any kind of anything on it. Short gain eleven, which is going to be eleven yards. Two five. So they have a, um, they've got a, coming up a second and, uh, let's see, second and seven. And we are going to reset the clock and the quarter. doing that and uh, they got a second and seven they're gonna go short to the split end I think it's second and seven hopefully it is second and seven possible defensive penalty and it's a 12 they are looking for the pass and uh, let's see 12 on Garoppolo's card and this was a short pass, so it's incomplete. Um, but defensive penalty, seven, and there isn't one, so it's third and seven. Third and seven from the 20 yard line. And they're going to go, oh yeah, I, had, I forgot to start the clock, but that's not a big deal. Missed one play. Um, they're gonna go short to the tight end. Short to the tight end, looking for the pass. That's a six possible defensive penalty, but short pass six is incomplete. And defensive penalty nine is opponent offsides. And um, they're going to refuse it because it's only a five yard penalty. So the 49ers are going to uh, kick a field goal, try a field goal attempt from the 20 which is good on two to nine or 12. And it is. And so San, um, San Francisco has themselves three points. And they will kick off. And I will take a drink. Okay, so the kickoff by San Francisco is a two, which is um, to the five, number two. And this time Seattle's going this way, so five, number two, number two back six on the kickoff return is a fair catch. Or wait a minute, no, it's uh, 19 yards. 
was looking at punt. So 10, 20, and back it off. One, and they have a first and 10, Seattle does, at, the, at their own 24-yard uh, line. They're going to come out and go end run with a halfback. They're not going to abandon the game plan just yet. They don't see any need to do that. That is a nine, and they are looking for the run. No, they're looking for the pass. They're still looking for the pass, and that is a nine end run on their halfback. And that's two yards, just two yards. So it's second and eight. They're going to go flat to the tight end on second down. And that is a 12 and a possible defensive penalty. They are looking for the, um, what are they looking for? Uh, yeah, it would matter because it's on the offensive card. So second and seven, second and eight. Uh, they are one to eight pass. So they are looking for the run. And this was a flat pass. And it is a 12 with a possible defensive penalty. 12 flat pass, not looking for it. It's a short gain. And we'll roll for the short gain, which is a 5. And that is something like 17 yards, I think. Um, it is 17 yards, but let's see if there was a defensive penalty. 5. And that is offsides. They're going to take the result of the play, which is 17 yards. 4, 10, 3. So they have a first and 10 at their own 43-yard line, Seattle does. And they're going to go back to the run. They're going to keep it on the ground. Even though they have the great um, uh, Russell Wilson, they're going to keep it on the ground. And that is a five. That's going to be on their card. And it, they're looking for the run. So it's an end run that they're looking for. And that is a fumble negative one on two. It isn't. So he loses a yard. So it's second and 11. They're going to go short to the split end. Short to the split end with 12.09 left in the pass. And that is a nine short pass on the San Francisco defense. And that is receiver. And they were looking for the pass. So it's the split end. That's a seven on the split. Short pass. It's incomplete. So they have a third down. They're going to go, you know what? They're going to go, no, they're going to go short. They're going to stay short, and they're going to go short to the flanker this time on third and uh, basically third and ten. And that is a six with a possible defensive penalty, and they are looking for the pass. Six short is incomplete, and the defensive penalty on San Francisco is six, which... I think is none, and it is. So Seattle has to punt. And that's a 10. It's another, another bad punt. Um, 44 back one. So 3, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 1. And back number 1 on the punt. Return. And that's a 4. And that's going to be a fair catch. So San Francisco is going to start first and 10. They have the lead. They're up 3 nothing, and they're going to start first and 10 from their own 14-yard line. And they're going to go end run with um, Mostert. And that is a four end run. They're looking for the run, but it doesn't matter. It's on the Seattle defense. And that is seven yards. So they have a second and three. They're going to go line buck with their fullback. The guy, the, uh, you know, the guy whose name I can't pronounce. And that is a six. And they're looking for the run. And it's a six on his card, line buck. And that is one yard. 
So there's been surprisingly few penalties here, uh, actual penalties. Um, and so now they have a third and three, and they're going to go flat to the tight end. Flat to the tight end, looking for the pass. That's an eight flat pass on the Seattle D is receiver, and that is the tight end. And that is an eight. No, nine. Nine on the tight end, George Kittle, and it's incomplete. George Kittle cannot make the catch, and so they will have to punt. And that's an 11. Everybody with the bad punts here. That's uh, 36 back one. So 3, 10, 20, 30, and 3. And back number one, returning it for Seattle. And that's a seven, which is going to be on the San Francisco punt return card and is nine yards. So they have a first and ten at the San Francisco 49, Seattle does. And they're going to, they're going to, you know what, they're going to come out here on first down. They're going to go long to the split end. They're going to see if they can catch San Francisco napping. They are looking for the pass, though, and that is a seven possible defensive penalty, but seven long is um, negative nine. It'll be a sack unless um, there's a penalty on San Francisco, <clears throat> and that's a six, and there isn't. So they do sack Russell Wilson, and now he has a second and 19. And he's going to try to get it back a little bit at a time. Short pass to the split end. And they are looking for the pass, and that is a six. Short pass six on Wilson's card is incomplete. So they have a third and 19. Third and 19. And they're going to go long. I mean, because basically... You're not going to get that on a short gain. They're looking past. They're just, we're just going to say they're looking past. And it's an eight, short pass eight on the San Francisco defense. Or no, is it? Long, no, long pass eight. It's receiver. So long pass receiver. And this is the flanker. And that's a seven on the flanker, which on long pass is 27 yards. Three, 10, 20, and four. So Russell Wilson pulls one out of his hat and he gets a first down at the San Francisco 31 yard line. And they're gonna go end run with a halfback. They are looking for the pass and that is an 11 end run on um, on Chris Carson's card and that's going to be eight yards so they've got a second and two they're going to go flat to the tight end they're looking for the run and that is an eight and there's a possible offensive penalty but it's an eight on the flat pass for San Francisco's defense which is receiver, and in this case is the tight end. And that is a six on their tight end. Flat pass is seven yards, but let's see if there was an offensive um, penalty, and there wasn't. So they do get seven yards on that. And they are down now to the San Francisco 11-yard line. And they're going to go short pass to the split end and try to pop it right into the end zone here. You would think it, at the very least they've got a tie. That is a five short pass. They're looking for the pass. And it is a five short on Russell Wilson, which is 13 yards and not a touchdown. No. It's down to the uh, three-yard line. So that he gets it down to the three yard line and now they're going to try to run it in. They're going to go end run with the halfback. 
end run with the halfback, that's an eight. Possible defensive penalty, and they're looking for the run. Eight end run um, on the San Francisco defense. It is zero yards, but let's see if they have a penalty. Three. They do not. So it is second and goal from the three, and they are going to... Um, this time they're going to try a short pass to the tight end. They are looking for the pass, and it's a possible offensive penalty. Um, it is a nine. Um, nine on, um, uh, on Russell Wilson's card, short pass, is must run if they were looking for it, and they were. And uh, he scrambles out. And he gets a well. He gets a he gets a touchdown. But let's see if there was an offensive penalty on Seattle. That is a ten, and that is opponent number three. And they're going to obviously refuse the penalty, and that is going to be a touchdown for Seattle. And the extra point for the Seahawks is missed on a, on eleven or twelve. And they don't miss it, so they do get seven. And it is seven to three here as the second quarter has only five minutes left and Seattle will kick off. Very close game, four on the kickoff um, to the three yard line, number two. So the number two back is returning from the three. And that is a seven, which is on Seattle's um, kickoff return card. And that is 17 yards. So it's out to the 20, first and 10 for the 49ers. We're now all of a sudden behind in the game. They were winning 3 nothing, But now they are um, behind and they have to do a little kind of a two-minute offense here. They're going to go short to the split end. And they're looking for the pass, and that is a two. Short pass two is 11 yards and a first down. And they are going to go short to the flanker on second down. Or on first down, sorry. They made a first down. They're looking for the pass, and that's a nine. Short pass nine on the Seattle defense is receiver. And that is the flanker. Flanker three, short pass, is um, is incomplete because they were looking for it. So second and ten, they're going to go short to the um, to the split end this time. On second down, they are um, looking for the pass. That is a nine short pass, possible offensive penalty. Nine short passes receiver, and this is the split end, nine. And that would be 13 yards, but let's see if they have an offensive penalty. Eight, I don't think they do. They don't, so it is 13 yards. So they have a first and 10 at the Seattle 44-yard uh, line. They're going to go short to the flanker now, back to the flanker. Still got time, especially with the timeout. That is a seven short pass. They're looking for the, the run, and that is a seven short pass, which is negative nine yards. So that was costly for San Francisco. They couldn't afford to get set for Garoppolo to get sacked. But that's exactly what happened. They got a second and 19. They're going to go long to the split end. They're looking for the pass, and that is an 11 long on the Seattle defense, and that's going to be negative 8. That Seattle defense is stingy, and really they've sacked Garoppolo two consecutive times. Now they're going to go long to the flanker and hope they don't get that Garoppolo doesn't get sacked again. Um, they, uh, the Seattle Seahawks are just looking for the pass. And that is a four long pass on Garoppolo's card, and it's incomplete. So, they're going to have to punt. 
those two sacks were key and uh, really put them in a bad way. But they did get a really good punt off this time. 59 back two. So 3, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and 1. Returning from the 19 and uh, back number two for Seattle. That is an eight, which would be on the San Francisco uh, punt return card, and it's only four yards. So they've got a first and ten at the 23-yard line. They are more or less content to go into halftime with the 7-3 lead. They're not going to do anything crazy here. So they're coming out, and they're going to go end run with the halfback. And that is an 11 end run with the halfback. They're looking for the pass. Um, and that is going to be eight yards. So they got a, a second and two. They're going to go flat to the tight end. Now, if they just happen to get down into scoring position, they will take it. That is a nine flat pass with uh, uh, on the uh, defense for San Francisco, which is receiver. And the receiver, uh, two, and that, that's the tight end. Tight end, two, flat pass is eight yards. And they have a first down at their own 39-yard uh, line. Time will stop on the uh, two-minute warning, which is considerably after the two-minute warning now, but time stops on this play. It won't run. <clears throat> they're going to they're gonna go short to the split end. I mean, they're going to say, what the heck, we're moving, so let's say. Uh, that is a nine short pass. They're looking for the pass, and that is incomplete. Russell Wilson, incomplete pass. So now they're going to go end run with the halfback. They're going to go back to that. Time will start up again. They are looking for the pass, and that is an 11, end run 11 on the San Francisco defense, which is seven yards. And now they've got a second and three, and they're going to go long to the flanker. Long to the flanker, and that is a nine long pass. They're looking for the run. So, nine long pass. No, no go. That's uh, incomplete. So, it's third and three. They're going to go flat to the tight end. They do want to at least keep possession, keep the ball away from San Francisco. And that is, they're looking for the pass, and that is a 12 flat pass anyway. And that is... Uh, negative two yards. San Francisco knocks them back for two. And now they have to punt. So they are going to punt the ball. And that's a nine. Not a great punt, but I don't think it matters now. 49 back one. So one, 10, 20, 30, 40, <coughs> and eight. And, uh, Back number one for San Francisco, and that is a five, um, and that's going to be 13 yards. So not bad. They have it first and ten at the 20, but of course, you know, there's only 41 seconds left in the half, and uh, unless they complete a pass on one of these first couple. They're going to go long to the flanker. Seattle's only looking for the pass. They don't care. They're not going to be able to run it all the way down the field. So that is a six. And uh, six with a possible offensive penalty. Um, long pass six is intercepted two to four or 12. And it isn't. And the offensive penalty on San Francisco is 7, which is not. So they're going to go 2nd and 10. They're going to go long to the split end. Pretty much this has to be a touchdown or the half will be over. 
or a penalty. Um, and there is an offensive penalty, but the half can end on that. Um, there is, they're looking for the pass, and it is a 10 long pass. <coughs> and it's receiver. So time has expired, but we're going to see if the split end catches the pass. 10. And he does not, because they were looking for the pass. So that is how the half will end. The first half, the score at the end of the first half is Seattle 7 and San Francisco 3. So let's go over some of the uh, halftime stats here at halftime, where the Seattle Seahawks of 2020 have a 7-3 lead, a very low-scoring game on the 2020 San Francisco 49ers. Um, as you can see, the passing stats, I've got the passing and rushing stats up here. I, I generally don't um, uh, keep track of receiving stats. Uh, those mean a little less to me. So if you look at the statistics here, you see that Wilson, uh, Russell Wilson for Seattle, 9 of 15 passing, 94 yards, no touchdowns, no interceptions. He was sacked once for negative 9 yards. Garoppolo for the 49ers has completed only 3 of 10 passes for 34 yards. And he's been sacked, um, I think, 3 times for negative 26 yards. Uh, rushing for Seattle, you got Carson with 9 rushes, 29 yards, a 3.2 average, and he lost one fumble. Wilson has rushed twice for 17 yards and a touchdown. Hyde has rushed once for one yard. For the 49ers, Mostert has four rushes for 33 yards. And uh, Scrabble has two rushes for one yard. So you can see really right here, at the tail of the tape, it's not surprising that the um, Seahawks are winning at halftime. They've had a lot more plays, it looks like, than the 49ers have had. Uh, the 49ers, it seems like they, they get the ball and then they do a three and out um, and they don't hold the ball very long. That's something they're going to have to work on in the second half. Uh, but, um, I mean, both teams, I would expect both teams to open it up a little when we go to the second half. So there are the statistics at halftime and we will get on with the second half of this game. So we are back for the second half of the game between the 2020 Seattle Seahawks and the 2020 San Francisco 49ers. And as you can see, the 49ers are losing currently 7-3 to the 49ers. But we let's see if I can... Uh, oh, there you go. But the 49ers will start out with the ball and... Uh, we will do the kickoff by the Seahawks. And that is a four on the kickoff, which is to the three, number two. The 49ers will return from this end. And the number two back, we will flip the card. That is a six, which is 16 yards. So they're out to the 19, first and 10. And uh, they will come out. We do have a change for the uh, 49ers in the second half. The second running back will not be the Scrabble guy. It will, in fact, be Jarek McKinnon, who rushed 81 times for 319 yards that year and five touchdowns. And they're going to go end run with their halfback to start things out. We will start the clock, and that is a seven, and uh, that's on uh, Garoppolo's card. Or no, wait, no, it's on the uh, running back's card. Seven, end run on the running back's card. It's a short gain for Raheem Mostert, and we will roll for the short gain, and that's a three. That's going to be 19 yards, I think. It is in deep in 10 for the 49ers at their own 38-yard line. And now they're going to go short 
to the tight end on second down. And that is a nine, and they're lo the Seattle's looking for the pass, so that's a nine on Garoppolo's card, and it's 12 yards. So they, the 49ers are come out and they're not playing around. They're at midfield now with a second down, or with a first down. And they're going to go end run with Mostert again. And that is a five. That's going to be bad. That's on the Seattle card. Or no, it's on, the, no, it's on Mostert's card. They were looking for the pass, but... Uh, it's a fumble zero, um, two to six, 11 or 12. Six, he does fumble, and two to six or 12, they get it back. They do get it back, so he gets no yards on that run, and it is second and 10. And they're going to go flat to the tight end. And that's a 12, and they are looking for the run. Seattle looking for the run, and this is a flat pass 12 on the Seattle defense, which is two yards. It's just two yards. Man, that's brutal. All right, so it's third and eight. Third and eight, they're going to go short to the split. Short to the split, they're looking for the pass. That is a seven on short pass on um, Seattle's defense, which is negative nine. You knew that was coming. So they will have to punt. And we will stop the clock for the punt. And that's an 11. It's another horrible punt by San Francisco. 36 yards back one, two, 10, 20, 30, and four. And uh, the return on back one is a nine. Punt return nine is a fair catch. So it'll be uh, Seattle's ball first and ten at their own 21-yard line. Now they have the lead, and um, and Seattle is or and San Francisco is average to poor against runs, so they are going to run the ball. Seattle has no changes to their lineup coming out here, and so the running back will be Chris Carson, and we will run the clock again, and that is a seven on Carson's card when they're looking for the run, so seven end run is negative eight, they were looking for the run and he lost eight yards. So they've got a second and 18. All of a sudden they have to go, they've got to, they're in passing mode now. They've got to go short to the uh, split end. Is what them and it's a six, uh, short pass six on the um, San Francisco defense. And uh, that's incomplete. So they've got a third and 18. They're going to go long. They're going to go long to the flanker. They're going to try to get it back. That is a 10, possible defensive penalty. It's the first possible penalty we've got. 10, uh, long pass on um, Russell Wilson's card when they're looking for the pass. And it would be 30 yards. And I don't know what, we'll see what the defensive penalty says, but you've got to believe they would re refuse most. Um, nine is... Opponent offsides, that's why you look at it. So it's opponent offsides, they lose five yards, and they don't get the 30-yard gain. And now they're just going to go off tackle on third and a long, long way. Four off tackle on the San Francisco defense is seven yards. And that's they'll, ha they'll take that. We're going to... Um, Uh, we're going to, there you go. It will be San Francisco's ball as soon as they punt. Unless there's a fumble. Eight on the punt is 50 yards back one. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Back number one is a four. And that is going to be a fair catch, and that's not bad field position. They're going to have it first and 10 at the at their own 35, San Francisco will. 
and they're gonna go they're gonna come out and go long to the flanker like come up for him 12 it's a possible defensive penalty but they're looking for the pass 12 long Seattle is a long gain but let's see first if there was a defensive penalty on whoa on Seattle seven I don't think there will be there isn't so it's going to be a long gain so we'll roll for the long gain and that is a six long gain six is 35 yards 10 20 30 and 5 and now um, San Francisco has a first and 10 at the Seattle 30 and they're going to go end run with most and that is an 11 end run on Mostert's card when they are looking for the run. It's three yards. So they got a second and seven. They're going to go flat to the tight end. And uh, that is uh, George Kittle. And that's an 11. Flat pass 11 on uh, Garoppolo's card is intercepted 2 to 5, 11 or 12. 8. It is not intercepted. It is incomplete though. And that is that brings up a 3rd and 7. And they're going to go short to the split end. And they are looking for, well it doesn't matter, it's a 7 on the short pass for Seattle. Again looks like a sack, negative 9, yep. So now they've got a decision to make because they are at the, and let's stop the clock while we make that decision. Uh, it, they are at the 36 yard line of Seattle. And from the 36, their field goal chance is two to five good. But they are a little too far away to try to get the first down, too. So they are going to try the field goal. And it is good! So San Francisco gets on the board with six. with Well, with a field goal, which makes it six for them. And now Seattle will have the ball after the, after the kickoff. God, you would think I could hit this, you know, 11, that is a uh, kickoff of a touchback. So Seattle's going to have it on the 25, first and 10, and uh, the score is now 7-6, to six. Seattle, they are only ahead by a point, and they are going to go end run with their halfback, 6 end run possible defensive penalty. Um, that is four yards, but let's see if there's a defensive penalty. Seven, I don't think there is. There isn't, so they get four yards. Uh, second and six, they're going to go flat to the tight end. Flat to the tight end, possible offensive penalty. It's a five flat pass when they're looking for it. And that is seven yards, but let's see if there's a penalty on them seven I don't think there is and there isn't so they get seven yards and that is a first down right now so they are Seattle has it first and ten at their own 36 they're gonna go end run with the halfback that is a possible offensive penalty and it's a six end run six on their running back is uh, four yards but let's see if they have an offensive penalty. Five. I don't think they they do. It's offsides. They're offsides. So they have a first and fifteen, and they're going to go end run with the fullback, and that is an eight and a possible offensive penalty. Eight when they're looking for the pass. So end run on Hyde's card eight, looking for the pass is six yards, but let's see if there was a penalty. Five, I think they're, they're, we just rolled that, didn't we? Offsides again. 
So uh, they have a, now a first and 20. First and 20, they're going to go long to the flanker. Uh, and that's a five, and they're looking for the, um, I think they're, I'm going to say they're looking for the pass. Five uh, long on Wilson's card is long gain. It's a double long gain. It wouldn't have mattered whether they were looking for it or not. No penalty on the play, so 10 um, on a long pass or on a long gain is 50 yards. 4, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 6. So they've got a first and 10 all the way down now at the San Francisco 24 yard line. And they're going to go short to the split end 12. Short pass 12 on Russell Wilson's card when they are looking for the pass. And that's going to be 12 yards. It's 12 yards either way again. So he completes it, and there's a first and 10 for Seattle now at the 12 yard line. And uh, this is going to be an atypical game for these two teams because the lowest scoring game from 2020 between these two was like 26 to 23. Um, I think Seattle won both games, but 26-23 was the lowest scoring game. Uh, they're going to go end run with the halfback. And that is a three end run on the, the uh, San Francisco defense, which is going to be a short gain, and it is likely going to be a uh, touchdown. In fact, well, let's see. I think it is eight. Yeah, that's definitely a touchdown. So Seattle is, let's see if they make the extra point. They do. So they have 14 now. And now the score is 14 to 6. And they will kick off. And that's a 5. 5 on the kickoff is negative 9 in the end zone. And uh, San Francisco will just take it on the 25. And San Francisco has to get things going here. So they're going to go long to the flanker. The clock will run again. And that is a five long possible defensive penalty. And it is incomplete. So they're going to go uh, in, in possible defensive penalty. Let's see if there is. Seven. I don't think there is. There isn't. So they're going to go short to the split end on second down. And that is a 10 short pass on the Seattle defense and it's 12 yards. So they get a first down. And they're gonna, with a, another first down, they've got another shot that they can take downfield to stretch the defense. So they're gonna go long again. And that is a five long pass when they're looking for it. <coughs> and that is incomplete. So they're going to go back to the short pass. But they are in a mode where they need to pass now because they're down by eight. Um, they're going to go short to the split end. Short? No, short to the tight end. They're going to go short to Kittle. And that is a four short pass on Garoppolo's card looking for it, and it's incomplete. So they're going to go short to the split end now on third and ten. And that is a five on Garoppolo's card, and it's a ten. Whether it, and it is both ways, so it doesn't matter. It's ten yards either way, whether you're looking for it or not. And they've got their first set of first down. They're going to go end run with Mostert. And that is a seven possible defensive penalty when they're looking for the pass. And that's going to be only a yard. But let's see if there was a defensive penalty on the play. That's an eight. There wasn't. So they got a yard. Second and nine, they're going to go flat pass to the tight end. Four, 
flat to the tight. It's an 11 with a possible offensive penalty. 11 flat pass, and that is a pickoff on a possible pickoff on Garoppolo's card. Um, they are looking for the the pass, so it's intercepted two to five, 11 or 12. It isn't, but it is incomplete, and um, so they will. Um, and they got a third and nine. And they're going to go third and nine. They're going to go sh short to the tight end. And that is a 10, short pass 10 when they are looking for the pass. And it's incomplete. So now they have to punt the ball on fourth and 10. And that is a nine. The punt is not good, but it doesn't matter from that range on the field. 46 back one. So 2, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 4. And they are going to return. And that is a 12. Um, let me see here. Back one, that was. Back one, punt return 12. Is oh, it's uh, referred to the uh, um, to the uh, San Francisco kick return card, and it's only three yards. So they have a first and ten at the ten at their own ten, and now they've got the ball, and they're going to go end run with the halfback because all they really need to do is kill clock. And that's a 12, end run 12 on uh, Chris Carson's card is 23 yards. No, they were looking for the run, so it's only a yard. So it's second and nine. They're going to go short to the split end. Short to the split end, and it is a six. It's on um, Wilson's card. And it's incomplete. And that is going to be the end of the quarter. We are, and I don't know why that said first quarter again. We are in the fourth quarter, obviously. And so, uh, and let me reset the clock. Okay. So it's 14 6 going into the fourth quarter. Seattle is up, um, and they have the ball. They have a second and ten, I believe, and they are going to go end run with their halfback on second and ten. I think it's second and ten. No, wait. It's I think it's third and nine because it looks like they gained a yard. Yeah, they gained a yard, so it's third and nine. Third and nine, they're going to go end run with the halfback which is uh, an unorthodox call, but we'll see how it works. Um, that is a 12 with a possible offensive penalty, and they're looking for the run, I think. Let's see if they're looking for the run. On uh, uh, third and... Oh, they're just looking for the pass. They're only looking for the pass. Oh, wait a minute. One to 14, so they are looking for the run. They're looking for the run, and it's an end run with the halfback, and it is on his card, and it's 12 possible offensive penalty. So Chris Carson is only going to get a yard, and we'll see if there is an offensive penalty on that. That is a 7, there isn't. But he only gets another yard, and so they do have to punt the ball. And that is a six. Seattle with the punt is 53 back two, so three, 10, 20, 
30, 40, and 50. With the 49ers returning from their own returning the ball from their own 35 yard line. And that's a three. Punt return three. Let me see here. Back number two is a fumble negative two. So let's see, two to six or twelve will get it back. They do. So he lost two yards, and so they have the ball, San Francisco does now, at their own 33-yard um, line. And they are going to go short to the split end. They're only going to get this ball just so many more times. So they're going to go short to the split end. And it is a four on um, Garoppolo's card, and they're looking for the run. And that's going to be 14 yards. So two, 10, and two. And they get a first down at their own 47-yard line. They're going to go end run with Mostert. They're looking for the pass, and that is a nine with a possible defensive penalty. Mostert end run nine is eight yards. But let's see if there was a defensive penalty. Four for Seattle is number five. There is a penalty on them. And uh, that is a, on a run. Four is personal foul, 15 yards from the concluding line of scrimmage and a first down. So they gained eight. And then they're going to get 15 on top of that. So it's going to be 1st and 10 for the 49ers on the Seattle 30. And uh, they're not going to waste any time. They're going to go short to the split end and try to pop it in right now. And try to get very close. 4. Short pass. That might be picked off. But there's a possible defensive penalty. But anyway, let's see. Short pass four. Yes, 15 yards, two to three, or 12. It's picked off. It is not. And uh, let's see if there was a defensive penalty. Seven. There is not. So it is second down and 10. They're going to go short to the tight end. Of course, they have another field goal, maybe, from here that they can kick. Six is eight. Um, it's eight short pass on the Seattle defense. Short pass eight is 11 yards. So they've got a first and 10 now at the Seattle um, 18, 19. And they're going to go short to the split end. And you can tell by the halftime stats, the defense has controlled this game in the first half. And they really have done a very good job here in the second half. Possible offensive penalty, and it's a six. Short pass six. It's going to be incomplete. But let's see if there is an offensive penalty. It's an 11. And there isn't. So they have a second and 10, I believe. They're going to go end run with Mostert. If nothing else, they'll get close enough, you know, closer for a better field goal try. Still plenty of time left. And that is an end run three on Mostert's card when they're looking for it. And it's going to be zero yards. So it's third and 10. They're going to go short to the split end. And that's a five short pass on the Seattle defense with a possible offensive penalty. Five short pass is receiver, and uh, this was to the split end. So that is um, Debo Samuel. That's a six, would be 10 yards, but let's see if there was an offensive penalty. Six, I don't think there is. <coughs> there isn't. <coughs> so that is a 10 yard completion. And now they have a first and goal. No, 
Yes. First and goal from the Seattle nine. And they're going to go end run with Mostert. And that is a 12. End run 12 on the Seattle defense is um, 8 yards, and it would be down to the 1. And it is, actually, because there's no penalties of any kind. Second and goal, they're going to go line buck with the fullback. So this is going to be the first run of the game by Jarek McKinnon. And that is a seven possible offensive penalty, and they're looking for the run. So seven line buck is um, no no yards, and let's see if there was an offensive penalty. Yeah, seven, I don't think there is. There isn't. So they got a third and goal from the one. And this time they're going to go line buck with Garoppolo. And... Uh, Seattle's in their goal line defense. Possible defensive penalty, and it's a six. Line buck six for Garoppolo. And that is going to be one yard. It would be a touchdown. Um, but let's see if there's a defensive penalty, I guess. That refers back to them, but they, it doesn't. There isn't one. So that is a touchdown. So, San Francisco and the extra point. Let's see if the extra point is good. They miss on 11. They didn't miss, so it is 13 for the, um, for the uh, 49ers. This is a really good game. They're going to kick off. And that is a 5. 5 on the kickoff it is negative 9 in the end zone. And uh, I think uh, Seattle is probably going this way. I should have switched sides of the field. I didn't. Um, but they're going to take it on the 25. And so now Seattle's going this way. Better late than never, right? And they're going to go end run. They've still got a point lead. So they're going to go end run with the... Uh, and you got to question maybe the decision not to go for two there. But there's still plenty of time left. They're going to go end run with their halfback, especially with all the timeouts. Seven possible defensive penalty, seven end run on Chris Carson's card. And that is going to be, they were looking for the pass. So that's going to be a yard. But let's see if there was a defensive penalty. And that's a six. And there isn't. So he only gets a yard at second and nine. They're going to go flat to the tight end. Flat to the tight end. Six is on the San Francisco flat pass defense. And it's a short game. Man. And that is a, is a five, which is, I think, 17 yards. And that is 17 yards. So... Uh, three, ten, and four, and they have a first and ten at their own 44 yard line. They're going to come out and go long to the flanker, and maybe try to put this game away right now, and catch San Francisco flat footed. That is a nine, and uh, it's on the uh, San Francisco long pass defense. Nine is a long game. That might have been exactly what they did. That is a nine. Nine on long gain is 45 yards. One, 10, 20, 30, 40, and four. So they have a first and 10 now at the uh, first and 10. At the San Francisco 11, that was a backbreaker right there. Potentially, they're going to go end run with uh, <coughs> Chris Carson, their halfback. He's getting a big workout today. That is a six, end run six. Possible offensive penalty, though. 
Um, end run six is four yards. Let's see if there was an offensive penalty on Seattle. Five. They are. They are offsides. So they got a first and 15. They're going to go end run with the fullback, and that is Carlos Hyde. And that is a nine, um, end run nine on, Seattle, on San Francisco's defense is two yards. And so they have a third and 13. Third and 13, they're going short to the split end. They're going to try to get the touchdown right now. And that is an 11, and it's on the short pass defense of San Francisco. 11 and that is a long gain. It's going to be a touchdown. What is this craziness? This is crazy Okay, so the extra point they miss on only um, Seattle only misses on 11 and 12 and They don't miss and so they get uh, seven more of their own and now it's starting to look more like a typical Seattle uh, San Francisco game as the score is now 21 13 San Francisco needs a touchdown and probably the eight point you know the two-point conversion on the uh, kick we will do the kickoff by Seattle it's a six negative eight in the end zone they'll take it on the 25 they still have time <coughs> but uh, they have to, they've got to score quickly. But it's still a one score game. They're going to come out and go short to the flanker. And that is a nine short possible offensive penalty. Nine on their short pass is receiver. And the receiver is uh, the, the flanker, and that is Brandon Ayuk, and he gets a 7, which is going to be incomplete. And let's see if there was an offensive penalty. 3 on San Francisco, there isn't. So they're going to go short again, this time short to the tight end. Kill. And that is a nine. Uh, they're looking for the pass, and it's nine, which is 12 yards. Double 12, so 10, 12. And it's first and 10 for the 49ers at their own 37. They're going to go end run with, um, with uh, Moster. That is a 12 end run. Uh, possible offensive penalty. End run on the Seattle defense is eight yards, but let's see if they had a penalty. Eight. I don't know that they do. They didn't, so they got eight yards. So it's second and two. They're going to go line buck with their fullback, the other new running back, and that's Jarek McKinnon. And that is a nine on his card when they're looking for the pass. Nine line buck is six yards. Not looking for it, so he got the first down easily and a little bit more. And they're keeping on moving down the field, but they need more than a field goal. They can't get just a field goal. They're going to go end run with Mostert. They still have the, the uh, two minute warning and their timeouts. So it's a six end run six on the Seattle defense. And uh, that is going to be two yards only. So they've got a second and eight. They're going to go short to the... Well, no, they're going to go flat to the tight end. Flat to Kittle. And that's a seven with a possible offensive penalty. Not looking for it. So it's nine yards. But let's see if there was an offensive penalty. Nine. There might be. But it's opponent offside, so they'll take the play, which is nine yards. 
So they've got a first and 10 now at the Seattle 38 yard line and this time won't move on this. This is the two minute warning. And they're going to go end run with Mostert. They still have plenty, plenty, plenty of time. And that's going to be an 11, end run 11 with a possible offensive penalty again. And uh, that's going to be six yards, but let's see if they had an offensive penalty. Eight. I don't think they do. They didn't, so they got eight yards. So they have a... Uh, Second and two, they're going to go off tackle with their new running back, Jarek McKinnon. And that is a five, and it's on his card, not looking for it. Off tackle is fumble zero, two to six, 11 or 12. Nine. He did not fumble, and so he got zero yards. It is third and two. And of course, you know, they're going to go for it um, if it comes to that. So they're going to go off tackle now with Raheem Mostert. And that is a six, and they're looking for the pass. And six is short gain. Short gain 10. That isn't a lot of yards. It's uh, going to be 12 yards. So they have a first and 10 now at the Seattle um, 18, and they're going to call their first time out. Yeah, Seattle 18. And they're going to go short to the split end. So time isn't moving because they're calling the time out. Day. And that is a 10 short pass Garoppolo and they are looking for the pass so it's incomplete. Second and 10. They will let time run on this play which is going to be short to the flanker. And they are looking six short pass and that is incomplete. They'll call their second time out, and this is, I believe, third and ten. So they are going to go short to the split end on third and ten. And that is a seven short pass. That's probably going to knock them back. Yeah, it does. Negative, negative nine. So they now have a fourth down and they can't kick a field goal. So they have to, let's see, what do they got to get? They got to get 10, 12, 20 something yards they've got to get. I think they got to go long because you can't guarantee you're going to get the needed number of yards on a short pass. So they're going to go long to the flanker and use their last time out. Six on a long pass on the Seattle defense is probably picked off. It is two to five or 12. It isn't, but it's incomplete and that's the same. That's just as bad. Seattle takes over with only 46 seconds left in the game, and they're going to go end run with their halfback. <clears throat> Unless they turn the ball over, that's probably going to be your final score. And that is a four end run on the San Francisco defense, which is seven yards. And they got a second and three. They're going to go off tackle with the fullback this time. Possible offensive penalty, and it's an 11 off tackle, um, which is two yards. And it's third and a yard to go, and uh, possible offensive penalty, I guess we'll check for that. Seven, it, there isn't one, and so they're going to go uh, 
uh, line buck with the uh, with the quarterback. And this will be the last play of the game. Possible defensive penalty, so, um, but we're going to let the half end if, even though it doesn't usually end on a defensive penalty. Nine, um, line buck on Russell Wilson's card is uh, fumble zero two. All right, well, let's see. He does fumble. 2-6 to six or 12, they get it back. They do. All right, so <clears throat> he fumbled. The ball was loose, but he jumped back on it. And so that is your final score, 21-13. Seattle wins a close one against San Francisco.